National kind of class is becoming a big hit at West Jordan Middle School. Administrators say it is helping to change students' attitudes. It's all about taking time to breathe. Tonight we take you inside the story of Dr. Yoga. My name is Audrey Kite. Sometimes life can be very difficult. I thought my life was ruined. And Even for a junior high student. I was getting really mad at my family really easily. Each struggling in their own way. There's been a lot of stress at home. And but at West Jordan Middle School. Tremendous amount of stress. Dr. Olin Levitt, who is a school psychologist, has come up with an idea to help relieve some of that stress students are experiencing. They need a lot of help right now. Ooh. Hi, guys. For 30 minutes a day, Monday through Thursday. All right, welcome to Pride Time Yoga. Dr. Inhaling. Levitt turns his office. Inhaling up. Into a yoga studio. Just let the stress. Rated candles and mood lighting. Close your eyes and make this kind of a little meditation. Yes, it may seem. Download, clearing the mind. And look a little odd. But according to Dr. Levitt. The stress melts away. And these students. Good job, Kyron. It works. It helps me do better in school and do better at home. Mercedes is another student whose life challenges carried into her schoolwork. I couldn't concentrate on my homework. We're going to inhale the hands up overhead. But now after coming to yoga, things have changed. I think that really helps when you get the good energy and it just downloads, you download it into your body. And Stress melts away. One thing is the breathing. Elena has also noticed a change in her attitude and schoolwork. I started to realize that I was being more calm and I was able to interact with other people a lot more. It, it made a profound difference, you know, in my life. Dr. Levitt is not surprised by the results. He's been doing yoga for 50 years, but it was only about three years ago he decided to get certified and take on the task of seriously teaching this class to help kids. You like to at least give them the opportunity to put a new tool in their toolbox. And that's what we offer with this. I think it's awesome. Principal Dixie Garrison believes it's making a difference with many of her 880 students. They've been able to change their behavior, been able to manage their anger better. The yoga class has proved so successful here that Dr. Levitt and the principal actually want to take it one step further. They want to integrate it with the detention program, something that apparently proved successful out east. It can maybe be a release for those kids, maybe get them thinking about their behavior more. All right, open your eyes. And hopefully open their eyes to less stress and a happier way of life. You guys did a great job. Ah, oh, it feels very calming. Dr. Levin has come up with different names for his yoga class, which include Mindful Monday, Torture Tuesday, Wacky Wednesday, and Thankful Thursday. For more on this story, go to our website, KUTV.com. Click on Features and Inside the Story. You relax now? I